Hello, Tab Trice here. In today's video, I'll be showing you how to cut a shape in Adobe InDesign. So without further ado, let's get right into it. So the first thing we want to do is to create our shape. So let's just go over to the toolbar in the left side of the screen and find the rectangle tool right here. And we can just right click on it and choose a shape we would like to use. In this example, I'll just be using a polygon tool right here. So just select that and let's just choose a color for our shape. So I'll just be choosing this blue color right here and let's just remove the fill just like this. Now go over to your document, just click and hold down shift to create a polygon tool with the same proportions, just like this. So now we actually have our shape right here. We are now ready to actually cut this. So from here, you want to decide where you want to cut this shape. In this example, I'll just be dividing the shape down right here. So now I want to go over to the toolbar again, find the polygon tool we have just used and then just right click and choose the rectangle tool. And let's just choose a white color, just like this. Then go over to the polygon tool, right click and choose now the rectangle tool. So you can also use the keyboard shortcut M to select that. Just click right here. And let's just create a line that goes through our shape right here. We can just center it just like this. And as you can see, if I just turn on preview, we can see that this is actually how we want this to look. But how do we actually cut this so we get two shapes instead of one polygon shape right here? All we actually have to do from here is to select both of our shapes we have just created, the rectangle and the polygon shape. Then we want to find the Pathfinder panel right here. And if you cannot see this, you can find it up in window, go down to object and layout and choose Pathfinder right here. And this panel will now show up. And all we actually have to do here is just go down to the Pathfinder and choose this right here, which is the subtract. And what this does is that it will subtract the, the frontmost objects from the backmost objects. So if I now press right here, we can see that the white rectangle we have created through this is now gone. And if I now try to select this polygon shape right here, we can see that we now only have one shape. But you can also see that if I try to move this, we still have one shape and we would like to divide this. So we have two different ones. You can fix that by just going up to objects, down to paths and choose release compound path and the keyboard shortcut for that is Control alt shift 8 just like this and if i now try to select our shape right here you can see that we now have two different shapes because we have divided this shape right here so yeah that is actually how to cut a shape and you can just do this with any shape you would like thank you so much for watching I hope you found this video helpful. Don't forget to subscribe and like the video. That was all for now. See you in the next one.